Hey everyone, this is the Chef of Buffalo, and I've got another budget builder for you, a 4231 German 8650 8, coin squad. So, first of all, we've got Weidenfeller or Weidenfeller Ingalls. Uh, I'm going to go through bios instead of just clicking X because somebody asked for that, so uh, we're going to do that. Uh, picked him up for 950 coins. Uh, you won't see any games played or anything on this because I did this immediately after getting the players basically. So he's quite tall, he's got good diving reflexes, he's a good shot stopper, the only problem is his kicking is quite poor and his speed as well. And then we've got Andreas back at the right back position, 400 coins for him. Although he has only got 2 star weak foot and 3 star skills, he is a wonderful right back. An absolute beast at the right back position, especially for his rating which is 75. We've got at the right centre back position, Huth for 750 coins. He has got a 3 star weak foot which is okay and although it seems like he has 64 pace his strength makes up for that. He is a outstanding defender especially again for his rating. We've got Howardies as well at the centre back position, 900 coins for him. Same weak foot and skill, foot as, uh, skill moves as well. He is right footed and he is as always in all of my German or Bundesliga teams, has been outstanding. A really, really good player. We've got Schmelzer up at the left back position, 1k for him. He has only got 2 star weak foot and 2 star skills, but he is probably the best left back you can get for a German squad. We've got uh, Bender, Lars Bender, at the left defensive mid position. Picked him up for 450 coins. He is a brilliant defensive mid and uh, tied up with the other bender for 1k uh, they make a brilliant team one stays back more than the other I think it's the Borussia Dortmund one uh, because he has got less pace but they have been really really good at the defensive mid rolls for me and at the right attack in mid we have Muller picked him up for 1.2k he's got that 4 star weak foot and 3 star skill so he can do decent skills and he is good at crossing the ball in or shooting with his left foot as well but uh, he mainly uses his right. We've got Holtby up at the centre forward position. 800 coins for him. And I can say it is definitely worth it. He is by far the best player in this team. And probably one of the best players or most fun players I've played on uh, with this game. He is an incredibly, uh, incredible centre forward. And then we've got Marco Marin up at the left attacking mid. 4 star weak foot, 4 star skills. Uh, decent pace, good dribbling decent well p quite poor shooting and passing but for a 78 this is quite good and then at the striker we have Kevin Kurani picked him up for 500 coins although he has only got two star weak foot and skills he is a brilliant striker he brings people into him which means that when he passes to Holtby or to Muller the ball instantly breaks through the center backs and he you usually get a goal out of it. So the first thing I'm doing is showing you a free kick with Holtby. Just showing that Holtby can take free kicks, Muller can take them from the other side I believe, or Marin, one or the other. Um, but they have got decent free kick takers and this is a wonderful play. That's what I mean. Kurani uh, brings players to him and then the runs come from the attacking mids or the centre forward and it's a beautiful weighted ball there and a Stunning uh, volley there from Bender. I believe that is the uh, Bayern Leverkusen Bender. Uh, so we've got Holtby putting a ball through for Muller, who loses it, but the persistent pay persistence pays off, and he manages to get a left-footed shot into the bottom corner of the goal, or at least the side netting and that's what I mean by Muller he's got that four star skills he's got enough pace enough shooting to be able to really scare the opposition and this is a nice goal as well a lovely ball over and a first time uh, lob there from Karani to put it over the keeper and looping into the back of the net here we've got also quite a nice goal from Holby who manages to do a Ronaldo chop and then a beastly finish into the bottom corner. Although he hasn't got the best shooting stats, he's, he's pretty good and that's what I mean about the passes as well. He's brought the sense back into him which left Bender loads of space to run into. He runs into it and the ball gets played and even with his 66 pace there is no stopping him. 
So we have come to the end of this squad builder. I hope you have enjoyed. This has been the Shuffle Buffle. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.